Hey guys, cool guy T258 here, back with another unboxing, and we have the HTC Vive. So now let's get to the exciting part and unbox this. So if any of you aren't aware what the HTC Vive is, nice padding to make sure it's secure. Um, it is a virtual reality headset and it is really cool. Um, similar in the, to the Oculus Rift, um, I'd actually say compared to the Oculus Rift, this is definitely a winner. It's got much better graphics. I've heard lots of people say it's much easier to record. Um, there's more games for it, more support. And yeah, it's just easier to work with. So now for the unboxing. So first thing I found is some nice instructions to get us help started. And believe it or not, it's actually really helpful instructions. Like it's not like the little manual that's just legal stuff. It actually has really um, useful information. So I will definitely give that a read when I'm setting it up. Um, we have, if I can pull it out. Geez, they really put it in, <laughs> put them in there. So here's a little sensor. Um, you put them six feet high in opposite corners of your room and they sense where you're going and well, like how you're moving with the, with the controllers or sticky things or whatever. Um, yeah, so they're just little blocks right now. <laughs> they don't, they're not the most attractive, but oh well. Um, now for the controller, as I pulled it out before, it's got a really interesting shape, like, <laughs> um, really uh, not like bulky. It's pretty big though, actually, I would say. Um, nice, comfortable, like wouldn't be become uncomfortable holding it after a while. Um, yeah, they're not too heavy. They're nice weight, not too light either. Just perfect. So you move around with them and the sensors track it. And so it moves around in the game. So let's put these over here. I'm very impressed with how well they packaged this. Like they didn't just put bubble wrap and say, yep, that's enough. <laughs> so now for the actually exciting part. Dun, 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 dun. It's the bag. No, the real show here, main attraction here is the HTC Vive headset. Um, the one thing that does suck with it is people have been saying like the wires do get tangled up because they come right out of the headset and they go behind you. So when you're moving around, they can, you can trip over them. Um, looks really nice. I'm gonna try it on. There's the camera. Let's try this on. Freaking. There, oh, wow, it's comfortable. And it fits really well over my glasses. It's pitch black right now, but wow, that is so cool. And, it, and the strap fits comfort comfortably over my head. Um, and it's easily adjustable. So if I did get a bigger head, got smarter. Uh, yeah, it's really nice. So that's it for the unboxing. Oops, I found some more stuff. I realized that you can pull these out and there's actually more stuff inside. So let's unbox this also. Um, and here we see a little bubble wrap. Uh, base station mounting guide. Oh, the guide for mounting the sensors. So I'll put that over there. And then this, this is just the mounting stuff, nothing too exciting. Like the screws and the nuts and bolts and stuff. Another bag, always exciting. Can we try and open this without completely butchering the bag? And we did. 
some cables of some sort. Um, oh, this is for connecting to the base station. So plug this in and go in, it goes into the base station. Base, where's the base station? I can't find the base station. Well, it'll turn up in a minute. Put this over here. Um, comes with a lot of stuff. Okay, can we open this? Apparently not, so one minute. So I grabbed some scissors and I opened it up because it was being a little difficult and I found it looks like a plug-in. Um, it's an AC adapter for, what is it for? It's not for this. Where is it? Um, it is actually, because I just checked and it actually fit. Um, oh well. Um, so it is an AC adapter for the sensor as it fits in. There's two of them and it fits right in. So you'd plug it in right into the DCN, as it's called. DCIN, sorry. Come here, put it there. Stuck. So we have two of them. I'm not going to open this one up because it's the exact same. Exact same thing, no point. Um, we got little bits of plastic. That's always exciting, some squishy stuff. Um, more packages. Oh, geez. What are these? There's a bunch of these little thingies. Unsure of what they are. Can I cut it open? Realizing how bad I am at cutting, can't cut a straight line. What is this? Oh, it's another AC adapter for a USB. I'm not sure what it is. Um, we'll find that later. More um, cable. Whoa, that almost went flying. They're not the easiest bag. There's like a little th uh, strip that's for opening it, or like pulling it open, but it's not the most, it's not, it's kind of difficult. Um, here it is, looks like. Oh, so you plug this in. Okay, so it's another uh, USB. Okay, connect to five watt adapter. So you plug this in into here, and I'm assuming we'll find out later what this connects into. Another one. So there's two of them, and then there's the link box, which not really exciting. I can pull it out. really stuck in there. Not really exciting, it's just a bunch of instructions for how to, and, and the link box which you plug everything into, like all the stuff, um, the headset, sensors, all that, and then you plug it into your computer. So not that ex exciting. So I can't put it back because of course, so we'll just put it here. So. 100% sure now we're done with the unboxing. So after a little research with the instructions, we found out that this plugs into this to charge the controllers. So there's two, that explains why there's two of them to plug both, so you can plug both of them at the same time. And then this is the sync cable, as these are wireless, but you do need to connect. Uh, um, so they sync up with each other, but if they cannot sync up with each other, 
use this cable and just manually connect them in. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you could help me out by leaving a like or commenting. If you don't want to leave a like or comment, that's okay. Just viewing my videos really helps me out. If you did leave a dislike, please tell me why, as I'm always trying to improve my videos. For more unboxings and gaming videos, be sure to subscribe for new content every week.